everyone mrs anderson is here and i wanted to come on today and read you a story about 10 little caterpillars as you can see there are caterpillars here on this book on the title page and it seems as though they're eating something do you know what shape this is it looks like a heart so let's read about these caterpillars and see what is going to happen in the book this is the front of the book this is the back of the book this is the spine of the book and these oh this is a big book and these are all the pages. The first little caterpillar. Let's see if you can see it. The first little caterpillar crawled into a bower. The second little caterpillar wriggled up a flower. Oh, look at those beautiful flowers. It is springtime, so the flowers are starting to bloom. I wonder, do you see a lot of flowers in Las Vegas? Because we live in the desert. I wonder, do you see a lot of flowers by your house? The third little caterpillar climbed into a cabbage head. Look at that, I see a toad. This is a winter squash and a beetle. It's right there. And this is the big cabbage that the caterpillar crawled up into. The fourth little caterpillar found a melon bed. Oh, this is a watermelon and we have a honeydew melon oh my goodness sounds so delicious i love melons the fifth little caterpillar sailed a garden pool where is he oh he's right there on that leaf and he is sailing around the pool the sixth little caterpillar was carried off to school oh no so someone must have found him and put him inside of this jar so now he's all alone inside of that jar and it seems as though he's going to someone's school the seventh little caterpillar met a hungry wren they have dragonflies on this page there's a dragonfly right there i love dragonflies The eighth little caterpillar was frightened by a hen. Oh no, it seems as though she's gonna eat him. The ninth little caterpillar fell into the sea. The tenth little caterpillar out oh, scowled an apple tree. So it seems like this caterpillar is eating some of the leaves that are on the apple tree. And hung there patiently. Oh my goodness, where is he? Did, uh, oh, he went into his chrysalis right there. So remember, a part of a caterpillar growing into another insect is that it goes into a chrysalis until by and by the tenth little caterpillar oh look at that it seems as though he's peeking his head out <gasps> became what is that a butterfly a beautiful butterfly
so the first caterpillar turns into a more a morning cloak this caterpillar feeds on tree leaves and wild rose leaves this caterpillar turns into a buck eye butterfly and he feeds on a variety of leaves including snap dragon leaves number three this caterpillar was a cabbage looper and he turned into a mop look at that little itty bitty mop i've always wanted to get um silkworms because you can use you can get silkworms and you can see moths number four was a yellow bear caterpillar and they chomp on tree leaves and leaves of the garden so when you're inside of a garden these caterpillars like to munch on those leaves and it turns into a virginian tiger moth wow the fifth caterpillar is a yellow necked cat caterpillar and it likes to feed on tree leaves and it turns into a moth as well the sixth caterpillar oh was a monarch caterpillar monarch caterpillars turn into monarch butterflies and it eats only milkweed leaves uh and monarch butterflies are so beautiful they are one of my favorite favorite butterflies number seven this caterpillar is called the painted lady and it turns into a painted lady butterfly and it looks beautiful just gorgeous number eight is the woolly bear caterpillar look at that it looks like he has a whole bunch of hair all over his body and this turns into the isabella tiger moth number nine is the common wood nymph caterpillar and he feeds on grasses in the woods and in the meadows and in the field and it just turns into this beautiful butterfly that seems as though it has a lot of browns and oranges and yellow let's see what the tenth butter caterpillar is going to turn into the tenth caterpillar it's a tiger swallowtail caterpillar and it eats shrubs and broadleaf tree leaves and it turns into a beautiful butterfly so a tiger swallowtail butterfly this is beautiful out of all of the moths and the butterflies inside of the book i don't know if you can remember but which one was your favorite mine i thought would have been the monarch butterfly but it's a tie between the monarch butterfly and the tiger swallowtail butterfly it is beautiful Thank you for reading with me. I will see you on our next story time. Bye.